You have heard this said a thousand times. You've heard it sung a thousand different ways. To God be the glory. What makes humility so desirable is the marvelous thing that it does to us. It creates in us a capacity for the closest possible intimacy with God. When we say in every moment, instead of to us be the glory, but to God be the glory, it is a profound thing that happens inside of us. We realize we're a part of something bigger than ourselves. 1 Peter 5, verse 5. God is against the proud, but God gives grace to the humble. Would you like to enjoy a more peaceful, grace-filled life? Then spend more time meditating on God's greatness instead of on your own. Contemplate your blessings and be sure to give credit where credit is due to your creator. One of the things that irks me is copyright. Uh, you know that I have a policy that my only copyright here at Positive Christianity with all the things we write is that you have a right to copy. It's absurd to think that it came from me. It came through me, yes, but it's all from God. I would sit down and not have an idea in the world of what to write or what to say on these videos, and it comes. And I think copyright in many cases restricts. I know of many cases where people have withdrawn their material thinking they own it. And while I believe that it's right and good to be paid for your work, and you will be, regardless of copyright, I believe it's important to share and to, to spread the good around. So, know that it is a wonderful thing to be humble, to realize that as good as your work is, that your source is always God. And never overestimate the importance of your own self and your own achievements in comparison to what we owe to God and owe to others. We are human beings who sometimes like to inflate our own accomplishments. But reality brings humility. When we really have moments, we realize in those special moments that it all came from God, not from us. When we see ourselves in the light of God's glory, we realize that God alone is worthy of endless praise. So instead of puffing out our chests and saying, look at me, we give glory to God. And we, we realize that the real joy in life the burden lifting joy of life is when we realize we're part of something bigger than ourselves. We know the incomparable comfort of God's grace poured out upon our hearts, our minds, our lives.